Welcome back, it's Friday the 8th of January. It's the beginning of the third semester. Indeed it is. Ooh, I like this music. You overhear a conversation. Hey, have you heard of this cult? Yeah, don't call it that if you don't know anything about it. The fall is coming. It's already decided. Oh, alright. That's weird. Oh, well, if it's already decided, then it can't be helped. By the way, how about the homework for second period? First bell has rung. Morning. Happy New Year, everyone. Winter break is over now. No more booze. Oh, you guys are underage. Wow, I feel sorry for you. Well, let's get right down to business. It's New Year, so we'll start with the basics. It's a simple concept, but students often get it wrong. I'm talking about the apostrophe. Okay, Yuki. Oh, no. No, not the apostrophe. No, I'm scared of the apostrophe. Of the three phrases I've written on the blackboard, tell me which one is correct. It's like, well, it's not it's apostrophe. It's like it is wrong. The is is abbreviated and it goes on to the it. Therefore, it becomes it's. So you put the apostrophe there because it is wrong. But if I say it is wrong, and it's that one, that's wrong, because it's wrong. Guess it was right. Even though it said it's wrong. It's wrong was right. Yep. That's absolutely right. It is a contraction, that's the word, of it is. It is a possessive word. You could say it's tail or it's temperature, but not it's wrong. There's another pair of words that are commonly confused. There and there and there, don't forget there. Have the same pronunciation, but there, not interchangeable. So watch out. Now, open your textbooks. You gave the correct answer. Your charm has increased. Do, 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 do. Hey, uh, you busy? Kinda, I was singing the music. Junpei came over to talk to you. Could you come with me for a sec? Oh. Uh, no funny stuff, okay? Come on, why the shifty look? It was a joke. Oh, he's terrible with my jokes. I just want to have a little chat. Um, let's go up to the roof. Um. Thought I said no funny stuff. Rooftop. You're alone with Junpei. It's almost coming of age day, you know? I used to just think of it as a day off. But now, I wonder if I'm even going to live long enough to celebrate it. Um, like you'd celebrate it. Ooh. What? You think I'm not ever going to mature or something? Yeah. It's been pretty weird around here lately. People have been passing out. Others have gone missing. Dude, it's crazy. Senpai said it's because there are too many shadow victims and the memory revision can't keep up. It's all gotta be because of this Nyx. <sighs> oh, and have you heard about that doomsday cult? They've been running around town telling everyone they see that the end of the world is coming. Man, we need to do something. And quick. Why? Uh, everyone's scared. Yeah, I guess they can somehow sense what's gonna happen. But it's not just Nyx, you know. Two members of Strega are still alive. Three. If we remember correctly, the phone call after Chidori died in Bunny Ears. In Bunny Ears. We're doing Bunny Ears right now. Yeah. Chidori died. But she didn't. She transmogrified. What? Well, became a coffin during the dark hour. I assume that was who the phone call was about anyway. They haven't done anything yet. But I know they've got to be planning something. And we need to take care of them too. Yeah, where are those guys? Man, to think I'd end up trusting such a cutie with my life. <laughs> I never would have imagined that happening last spring. <laughs> but then again, I never thought it would come to this. Junpei is looking far off into the distance. You know, I don't think it's completely hit me yet. It's just all so hard to believe. But that doesn't mean we should just sit around and wait for it to happen. Indeed. You're pretty cool, man. Thank you. That thing was inside you for 10 years, and you harnessed its power and made it your own. Yeah, that's what I did. What? 
Junpei turned to face you. I know I've run my mouth a lot since the day we met. And yeah, maybe I called you cutie a couple of times, and you might have thought I was making fun of you. Nah, I just thought you were a creep. But I'm totally serious when I tell you. I'd trust you with my life. I'm... I'm glad to know you. It's embarrassing to say it, but... But that's really how I feel. It's good to hear from Junpei. We'll always be friends, right? I mean, even after this is all over? It depends if you actually start understanding my jokes, but okay. Um... Just friends, eh? It's like, more like best friends. I mean... I do give Junbei a hard time, but that's what I do with people. So yes, more like best friends. Best friends. I mean, I can be best friends with more than one person, so. <laughs> I'm kind of embarrassed to say so, but I like the sound of that. You exchange a firm handshake with Junbei. Class has ended for today. Right, let's speak to I guess, because I want to really try and start a social link. I may have to check on the internet to see what day it starts, because I don't want to miss it. Yuki-san. It's been a long time since I first came to this school. My outlook on many things has changed. I'm not sure these changes are for the best. Yuki-san, do you have any plans after school lets out? Oh, this is going to be the start of the social link, isn't it? If it's alright with you, I would like to walk home with you. Walk home with her. I'm glad to hear that. Oh, but there is one place I would like to visit before returning to the dorm. I mean, I could have done Akihiko's, but I guess is more important to my story, so. Shall we go? I mean, I, I do want Akihiko's max S rank persona, but story. Naganaki Shrine. I come here a lot today. Today, lately, today. Before, I couldn't understand the benefits of coming to these places called shrines. But lately, that has changed. This is also where we met Doggy-san last summer. He waited here until we found him, even though he knew his master had died. Now I can understand his reason for doing that. What drives people isn't necessarily facts, but feelings. He knew for a fact that his master had died, but his feelings of wanting to be with him made him stay. It's the same for me. I, I like it when she smiles. It suits her. I, has, I have grasped the fact that I can't protect you, yet here I remain. Subconsciously, I was following my feelings rather than the available data. I was so confused at the time that I didn't notice it, but to tell the truth, it seems that the reason behind my behavior changing while I am with you, Yuki-san. What? You feel a bond forming between you and Igis, who has become more human. Oh, it's got a gold one. That was I and I am now. That was established a new bond. That shall be blessed in creating persons of the Aeon Arcana. Oh, so she's basically Marie in terms of social link. You have established the Aegis social link of the Aeon Arcana. You may earn an XP bonus when fusing personas of the Aeon Arcana. Don't think I can make an Aeon Arc uh, Ar an Aeon Arcana, an Aeon persona that can help with this. Don't know. Seems that this is a new Arcana, the Aeon social link. Oh, I have a correction to make. I talked about what drives people. But of course, Doggy-san and myself aren't people. You are. She chuckled. She actually chuckled. I'm sorry. All the dots. I guess it looks somewhat lonely. You decided to go back to the dorm. She actually chuckled. Where have you been? Outside. It's not any of your business. The term seems like any other term. I don't care about what's going to happen to the world. All I'm going to do is keep moving forward. So let me know when you want to go to Tartarus. Oh, I will do, don't you worry. Ken, social link, you Ken? Are you Ken? Ken, are you Ken? I think Ken is Ken. Let's just check in on I guess I just make sure, make sure. 
didn't expect that call to become so popular. I thought more people would oppose it. But it's like a fire drawing moths to its flames. Indeed it is. Right, let's go to our room. And go to sleep. Yes. The ninth, a Saturday. Class has ended for today. Social link, social link. I'm Yuki-san. I want to be by your side. Agus is looking directly into your eyes. Would you like to spend time with Agus after school? Yeah. Thank you very much, shall we go? I like her smile, I really... There's something about her, her sprite right there. The, the smile is just so cute. It really, she looks like so, so happy. So happy. I mean, it says at the bottom, I guess, seems happy. She really does. She really does. Kukukun High School, rooftop. I like this place. I can see the entire town from here. The moonlight bridge is to the right, and over there is the mall. Oh, and did you know you can also see our dorm from here? The ocean waters at Yakushima, where I had been sleeping, were clearer than these. But I prefer the view here. All the dots. Before I came here, things such as liking or disliking the scenery never entered my mind. What about you, yuki -san? Do you like this town? I like it. I like it. I'm glad to hear that. All the dots. Feeling the same way as we view the same scenery. It feels nice. I guess it's smiling. Oh no, don't, don't, no, no. Get your face back up here and smile. How dare you. Many feelings towards various things I had not recognized before are making themselves clearer now. It's a little scary sometimes. All the dots. But if I can change by being with you, I want to hold on to this feeling. Yeah, her smile's back. You can feel strength budding from within, I guess. Rank two! Level 2, Aeon. Oh, I'm sorry to have gone on for so long. It's still January, so I imagine that you are quite cold. I mean, yeah, I am quite cold right now. It is January. It is January right now from my point of view, by the way. Right now it is January. Even though it's February from your point of view, it's January for me. It would be awful if you caught a chill. Although, if you're listening to this in the future in a different month, it's not February. But I put the timestamp in the corner on the intro. That's the thing. That's what it's called. So, yeah. We decided to go back to the dorm. Evening. Sup, dude? Oh, oh, oh. Only three more weeks till X day. But it's weird. I was pissing my pants all last month. But since I decided that I was gonna fight, I'm not scared anymore. Hey, let's go to Tartarus, man. We gotta do what we can do, right? Well, yeah, but not yet. Ken? No, Ken? 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 Ken! Right, let's go to the room. I don't, I don't know why I'm doing all this Ken stuff, by the way. It's just uh, weird. It's just weird. I don't know. I'm in a happy mood today. Might be the Agus social link has made me happy. Don't know. There's no school today. Daytime! Could be the music. Doom, doom. I guess we'll speak to I guess I want to make sure that we're not missing. I didn't expect the call to become so popular. Yeah, 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 yeah. Anything going on here? Nope. So let's go outside because I don't want to miss the night time. I might miss a social link chance with Ken and I don't want to miss that. Arf, arf. Nope, because Ken's just, just sitting there at the table. Alright, so let's go back to our room. The 11th, a moon day. That's not a moon day, is it? It's just a Monday. Today is coming of age day. There's no school. Is it I guess ringing us up? Your phone is ringing. Yo, Jumper here, you got some time? It's okay. Hey, you wanna do something today? Nikamara. What should you do? Accept the offer. Alright, I'll be waiting downstairs then. 
Junpei seems excited. Daytime. It was a nice trip mall. I didn't notice that this area gets pretty busy during the holidays. I never really had much business here besides the restaurants and manga cafe. Junpei is looking around, seemingly intrigued. Development seems to be moving forward around here to these... What, well, here too these days, there we go. Doesn't it surprise you to see new buildings pop up suddenly? This area is probably gonna go on changing too. Junpei seems a little sad. But you know, our memories of having fun here with our friends will last forever. I don't think how to put it. Might I get a thing from? From below it probably. I don't know how to put it, but I think it's really important to have memories of your friends. It's something I've been thinking about more lately. Oh man, am I sounding like something out of a shonen manga? No, you're sounding like someone out of Persona 4 right now. Maybe that's why I'm enjoying it more right now. Because I was starting to lose... Not hope in the game. Starting to lose interest. Yeah, I well, was starting to lose interest in the game in December. But now I've got into January. And there's all this stuff going on where it's all about they're becoming friends and they, they're working together as a team and all that sort of thing. It's like, this feels more like Persona 4 right now. And I like it as a result. Um... Yep. Yikes, an absolute yes. Man, you really go for the throat. But maybe me embarrassing myself with stuff like that will be one of the, our good memories. God damn it, now I'm really starting to get embarrassed. Jumbe is scratching his head. He got the joke that time, though. Today you learned something new about him. You recall that you have something you can give him as a present. Some sweeties. What kind of present should you give? Sweeties. Which item will you give? Sweeties! Oh, we ran out of cookies. Truffled then. What's this? Is it for me? Wait, whoa, seriously? You... You... You made this for me? It's beautiful! This is handmade, isn't it? It looks so good! Thanks for the food! Munch munch. Oh man, this is delicious. It's like a party for my tongue. Thanks. I wouldn't mind if you made me something again sometime. Junpei seems to really love your present. Everybody does. Everybody loves my cooking. Every day is great with my cooking. It's starting to get dark out. You decide to go back to the dorm. Every day is great at your Junes. Hello. Hello. Today is coming of age day. I don't want my life to end before I become an adult. Hey, let's go to Tartarus tonight. I don't want to see the world end. What's with the bit with the Tartarus shoved in there? That was that seemed a bit odd. It's like, I, I don't want to die. Let's go to Tartarus. It could be really, really bad if I died. Like, what? What? You did what with Tartarus? What? You can't just do that. That's weird. Ken's getting stranger. Doom, 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 doom. About the cult. I wonder how many people truly believe in it. it seems much of the public is openly saying that the end of the world is coming. Yeah, even people I know. Most of them got interested through friends. I heard some people talking the other day too. They were saying that every day is so boring. At your tuners? No, surely not. The end of the world wouldn't be so bad. In other words, the cult is kind of like shopping. It helps people feel the emptiness they feel inside. Ooh. Ooh. Hmm, I got theories about that in my head. I don't want to say them yet, but we'll, we'll see where it goes. Um, so your room. I'm gonna go to sleep. Go to bed. Yep. The 12th for Tuesday. Forgot to mention. You overheard a conversation. Lately, even the late night comedy shows have been talking about the end of the world. It feels creepy. Are you still talking about that? By the way, I wanted to show you this magazine that hit the stands today. Magazine? Don't tell me it's about the cults. Well, just read it for yourself. You'll see how true it really is. The first bell is rung. Hmm. It's finally time for lunch. Hello, Makoto. You seem to be doing well. Do you have any plans after school today? I'd like to talk to you. Uh, so far, nothing. I see. 
Well, would you mind keeping me company? I don't have anything to do today. Let me know what you decide. Mitsuru wants to spend time with you. Maybe you should spend some time with her. Nope, got Agus to do. The lunch break is almost over. You decided to return to your classroom. Afternoon. Phew, it's cold. I should have... have my skin plated. Why? What? I'd shine as bright as the sun. You all know what plating is, right? It's a process to cover objects in a thin metallic layer. Yeah, but wouldn't that make you colder? Maybe not, actually, because it might reflect the heat back in. Hmm. Tin plating is done by plating iron with tin. For corrugated galvanized iron, you plate iron with zinc. Gold medals, by the way, are created by plating silver with gold. So technically, Olymp Olympic athletes don't win gold medals. Well, they do, because they look gold. It depends how you're applying the word gold. If you're talking about the material, the contents, mostly not gold. But if you're talking about its colour on the outside, so you're like, what colour medal did you win? You won a gold medal. So it's still technically correct. It's kind of sad. You feel tired. Close your eyes a few minutes. Yeah. You, your consciousness drifts away as you close your eyes. You start to feel better. Your condition is now great. Up to school. Class has ended for today. Alright, so I guess doesn't seem to be around. So, let's go see if we can do another social link then. It's a Tuesday. There's Bebe. We'll do Bebe's. No, no, no. <laughs> As if I do Bebe's. This is June Council Room. The door is locked. Mondays, Wednesdays, Fridays. Okay. Alright, so let's go see Mitsuru then. There you are. Makoto, what a coincidence. Are you on your way home? If you're not busy, would you like to do something? Mitsuru seems to want to walk home together. I'm really liking this music. It's got the mood perfect. Perfect. Like I said, that week where we had nothing to do. That one week. They'd done something with the music. It would have been perfect, but no. Would you like to spend time with her after school? Spend time with her. I see. I need to do a little research. Because, yeah, thinking about it. That kind of thing happened in Persona 4, where there was like nothing to do. It was all with the it's spoilers by for Persona 4 if you haven't played it, by the way. So jump ahead till the social link starts, basically. You know, there's your warning. Right, so when the fog descended on the town and it got all slightly depressing and the mood worsened, etc., etc., and it went sort of like this greeny color fog. The music changed with it, and it had that sort of weird music where it's sort of ominous. That's what it needed to do. So anyway, let's proceed onwards. And I was wondering if you'd like to come with me. Mitsuru seems a bit wary. Kakun High School Library. We're going to the library? Mitsuru has a languid expression, I think that's it, on her face. We only have a short time to be together like this. Soon we'll be looking back nostalgically on these times. What's next for you? I... I haven't decided yet. Mitsuru's expression turned dark. Since my father passed away, I've been faced with many difficult problems. My inheritance, the future of Kiryojo... 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 Always get that wrong. And the expectations of everyone involved with both. Most likely I won't be able to attend college or begin a profession. I will have to find another path. Mitsuru looks unusually timid. Say, Mikado, what are your thoughts on marriage? Uh, n no, 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 you, you're alright. I, I, I don't want to get married. You, you don't have to ask. Um, the end of your life? No, it's like I've never considered it. <laughs> well, that's only natural. We are still high school students after all. All the dots. Mitsuru seems down. This is what I think. A marriage is a social contract. You're not just linked body and soul, you are linked to each other's social backgrounds as well. My parents' marriage was arranged for strategic reasons. But as time passed, they slowly grew to love each other. I don't consider them unfortunate. Love comes in all different forms. Do you disagree? What? But your boyfriend... You should know I don't have one. 
We're living under the same roof, aren't we? Mm-hmm. Then why do you seem embarrassed? I'm not very good at romantic relationships. Besides, I don't have any spare time to devote to another. Mitsuru seems offended. Uh, all right. Jeez. Can't believe the library is closing and we're still here. I mean, it's just a joke again. No one gets my jokes. Ah, uh, talking in the library. I'm not setting a very good example as student council president. We should go. You listen to Mitsuru as she talked about her persona problems. Yep, personal problems. You feel that you understand her better now. Rank 4. I'm not going to finish that one in time. Mr. Kuriju, Social Link, Empress. You left the library and decided to return to the dorm. When you returned to the dormitory, Junbei greeted you like he was waiting for you. Oh, there you are. Hello. We're all going to uh, Hakakure. Want to come? Sure thing. Definitely. Wow, that was easy. That's nice food, isn't it? Akihiko-san's buying. Him and me had a little bet in Yakushima. I can't really go into details, but in the end, I guess you're the one who actually won. Yay! What? <laughs> you didn't even know you were part of it. But I won! Well, I don't look a gift horse in the mouth, you know? Anyways, I've just been waiting for you to get back. Everyone else already left, so we got a jet. Oh, it's an ice strip mall. Akikure Ramen. Akihiko, Agis, and Yukari are already sitting there. Is the special okay for everyone? Yep, sounds good. Okay. Five specials, please. Man, this is awesome. Akihiko-san's never treated us all to ramen before. Hey, why do I have to treat everyone? My bet was only with Junpei. <sighs> Not this again. Come on, Akihiko-san. A bet's a bet. Pay up. What's the bet? All right, all right. I never said I wouldn't. What's wrong, I guess? You doubting me too? No, but have you seen the magazine on that counter? There's an article in it that looks highly disturbing. Which magazine? It's this one. Emergence of a Messiah. The charismatic one speaks. I guess brought over the magazine and handed it to Hakihiko. Uh, it must be about that doomsday cult. They're all over the internet, too. Huh? Hey, look at the photo in this. Check out the so-called Messiah. What the? It's Straga. I is that Takaya? Yep. Takaya, or Takia as I call him, is indeed grinning provocatively in the article's photo. I thought something was up. So, Strega's behind that cult. Tch, I've lost my appetite. Disgusted, Akihiko passed the magazine back to Igus. Listen to what he says. Mankind is currently imprisoned by the sins of hate and anger. But soon, a savior will descend upon this world to break the chains that bind us and lift us to new heights. This great being is Nyx. I have beheld her glory, and she has blessed me with power beyond belief. In Nyx, there is no pain, no suffering. How the hell does he know about Nyx? Wait, he's saying that Nyx will save the world? That's not true! I don't think he really means what he's saying. This is all just a game to him. That son of a bitch. But there are those who do not understand this truth, even though they have also been blessed by her. They have acquired the same power as I, yet they abuse it, using it for their own personal gain. These miscreants are the ones to blame for the recent tragedies that have been plaguing our streets. Oh, crap. Wait, is he talking about us? Shh, not so loud. Oh, sorry. Hey, what's up with them calling him the charismatic one? How'd he get so popular all of a sudden? Well, Jin's pretty well known on the internet. He's probably pretty good at stirring up trouble. Yeah, I bet he orchestrated Takaya's rise to fame. Ugh. Those two make me sick. 
Brothers and sisters, I shall go forth to make preparations for Nyx's arrival. But do not fear those evildoers who desecrate their gifts. Nyx shall right their wrongs. May your hearts be filled with peace as you await your salvation. Blessed are those who take joy in the coming of Nyx. The revolution is here. Revolution? People can't seriously be buying this crap, can they? Throughout history, those who have changed the future have often been highly charismatic. That's the end of the article. It appears that after the interview, Jin and Takaya disappeared again. Well, there's only one place they could have gone. Tartarus. What? They, they could have gone loads of places, but alright. They must have been planning this all along. Takaya's words have changed the mood of the entire city. Indeed. Even though they won't admit it, they are all afraid. See, this is what I'm thinking right now. This is what I was, I was mentioning earlier that I've sort of got this theory. Going off stuff I know from Persona 4 about how shadows and sonas, etc. work. And like the Midnight Channel itself and how that worked. People's emotions are connected to the shadows. That's essentially what they are. So is the city or mankind as a whole calling forth Nyx? Is that what's going on? And Straga as a result of making it worse. And that's the reason that Nyx is coming because of what Straga have done. Maybe? I mean, it's, something, it's still something to do with 10 years ago, though. Maybe the stuff 10 years ago caused it to be possible. Straga sort of learnt this and manipulating people's emotions so they're sort of like calling forth Nyx. Hmm. So maybe the way to beat Nyx is to convince people otherwise? Be a bit of a weird end, but, you know. Yeah. Yeah, it would. Yeah, alright then. Thanks, Yukari. I mean, why else would people believe this nonsense Takai is preaching? Well, I guess people just need something to believe in. Well, no wonder there's a sense of doom in the air. We're all gonna die. But is that so surprising? The fact that all life ends one day has nothing to do with Nyx. Death is a natural occurrence in the cycle of life. Don't all humans realize this? I have. I've been, I've been saying that for quite a while now. I guess. To tell you the truth, I never even would have thought about my own death if none of this had happened. But since we've made up our minds, why don't we just leave it at that? Our objective is Nyx. If Strega gets in our way, we'll just have to deal with them too. I agree. We'll probably run into them at Tartarus anyways. However you look at it, we're the obstacle standing in their way. The promised day will soon be here. Um, I say bring it on! <laughs> as fearless as ever. Alright, and if that's the case, we're gonna need lots of energy. Let's eat! Oh, I thought Judgment was going to rank up then. Alright. Excuse me, I'd like to order a Hagakure bowl. Junpei, don't forget you're having half of Igus's food too. Oh, don't worry, I'm starving. You just better eat it all. Oh, alright, we're, we're back at the dorm. Ken! Make sure we speak to Igus though. Where's Igus? Well, that was Igus, wasn't it? I have to admit, Strega knows how to control the media well. Yeah. That's my point, if they're using the media, and maybe like Jin's got the capability to spread the message around the world, maybe they're making mankind despair more, or something like that? Hmm. But I'm a little disappointed in the media for being so easily controlled by them. Ha <laughs> ha! Cause that would never happen these days, would it? <laughs> no, no, no. Do you think the media were paid off by Strega to promote them? Actually, that would be even more disappointing. Huh. This is this is really starting to seem like Persona 4 right now. Really, really is, because that was all about how the media media influenced things. And that seems to be where this is going now. Very odd. Persona 3 is basically ripping off Persona 4 right now. What's the matter, Yuki-san? That was a joke, by the way, in case you're wondering. 
three is a number before four, I do understand that. Because there will be some people who will be like, no, no, Persona 3 was first. It's like, yeah, I know, that's the joke. To the rest of you who got the joke, well done. Spend the evening with Ken? Yes. Okay, well, let's go. Ken seems happy. Oh, to a nice trip ball Wakatsu restaurant. Munch, munch, this is delicious, Yuki-san. You and Ken chatted over your meal. I should have brought a persona. It's time to get late. We decided to head back to the dorm. Yeah, I should have brought a persona. The 13th, a Wednesday. It's finally time for lunch. Hey, are you coming to the student council today? Assuming there's no I guess? Yes. I plan to. I see, I want to talk to you about something. I'd appreciate it if you came. Well, excuse me. Seems Hitoshi has something important to discuss with you. Maybe you should go to the student council room after school. Nope, we're doing Argus's. Hello, Yuki-san. Are you available after school? For now? I see. Would you be interested in walking home together? I want to be beside you. Seems that I guess would like to spend time with you after school. Maybe you should spend some time with her. But of course. Priority is I guess. The lunch break is almost over. You decide to return to your classroom. After school. Really like this music. Class has ended for today. Um, Yuki-san. I want to be by your side. I guess is looking directly into your eyes. Would you like to spend time with her, I guess, after school? Yeah! Thank you very much. Shall we go? That smile! I really like that smile! I guess seems happy. In front of Irotodai Station! As you arrive, with I guess, you feel a threatening presence. Oh, great. Oh. Grr, bark, bark. You've been suddenly surrounded by stray dogs. They seem angry. You're the ones that I often see at the shrine. What is the matter? I guess began talking with the dogs. Huh? Doggy-san? We did that? Wait, we aren't mistreating Doggy-san. It's true that he's helping us in our battle, however. The dogs drew closer to I guess. No. Alright, um, these dogs are Doggy-san's old friends. They doubt our intentions regarding Doggy-san since he has been more frequently injured lately. How can we make them understand? Um, we can talk it out. This is all a misunderstanding, everyone. Grrr. They don't seem to want to listen. It's worth a try. Please don't be angry. Calm down. I get stretched out her hand to one of the dogs. Oh. Ha <laughs> ha that's what you get. I guess seems to have been bitten by a dog, and it broke its teeth. Yelp! Oh. I'm so sorry, my hand is hard. Wine! The dogs ran away. I see. No wonder they doubt me. They are confused since my body is not natural. I hope that dog isn't hurt. All the dots. I have been thinking lately. Although my heart may become more human, my body will forever be mechanical. Doesn't matter. Of course, that is how I was designed. But I'm not strong enough to be a weapon, and I'm too rigid to pass as a human. I'm neither fish nor fowl. No, not completely machine nor human. All the dots. That's not true. But, all the dots. Oh, I'm sorry, Yuki-san. Thank you very much. You're right. Even if I can't quite explain it, I have to be true to myself. All the dots. I guess there's a painful smile on her face, but it is a smile. I'm sorry for saying such things. If I hadn't been created, I would never have met any everyone. And that includes you. I can stay by your side. If I can stay by your side, then nothing should faze me. You sense faint affection from I guess. Rank 3. I guess social link for three. I I I I I I I I I on. I should make sure that the dogs understand our situation. 
I w it would be bad if you were placed in danger again. I'll see you later. Excuse me. He parted with Argus and went back to the dorm. Hey, Dad. Hi, how was your day? That's good. I mean, I saw this dog basically try to bite Igus and it did nothing. It's already the middle of January. That's not. Since today is the 13th, we only have 18 more days. That's not the middle then. Let's go to Tartarus today. Nope. Even though I might be overdoing it, I still want to do as much as I can right now. Alright, so Ken, 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 can't do Ken, so our room... Wait, nope, speak to Igus. Have to admit, Strega knows... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, so, your room! And sleep. Yes. The 14th. A Thursday. You ever hear a conversation? I got a flyer at the mall when I went there last time. It's the same one that's plastered all over the city. The one with the Nyx logo. Oh, so that's how it's pronounced. I just like the logo's design. The stuff written here is kind of interesting too. Maybe I should ask them about it next time. The first bell has rung. Lunchtime. It's finally time for lunch! Yo, it kind of feels weird running into you in the hall like this. Oh hey, you free today? Wanna go somewhere? If I'm not busy. Okay, just let me know after school if you do. Seems like Junpei doesn't have much to do after school. Just depends on I guess once again. The lunch break is almost over. You decide to return to your classroom. Class has ended for today. No I guess around? If not, it's Junpei time. Oh, missed. Hey, are you on your way home? Seems Junpei wants to walk back to the dorm with you. Nikomara. Spend some time after school with Junpei? Oh really? And let's stop by somewhere. Junpei seems happy. Ooh, there's the signs as well. Crazy. Nagadaki Shrine. When you look closely, you can see a bruise under Junpei's eye. I, I can't, because his, his baseball cap's in the way. Um, did you notice? Don't stare at it too much. It's just a punch. Did you get in a fight? Um, well, who cares? Don't bother asking, okay? It's really lame. I don't want to say it. Junpei scratches his head. Well, in any case, I don't think there's going to be any more photos of you going around. Um, thank you. Uh, uh, um, uh, <laughs> Junpei's face is bright red. I think this is my first time. First time for what? Getting punched? <laughs> I've been punched way too many times before. Junpei shrugs. I thought that if I left my way out of everything, I had never be in trouble. That's why I try to avoid having to be serious whenever I can. Oh! I appreciate him so much more now. You know those times when everyone sits around and takes talk seriously? Take seriously? Talk seriously? I really don't like those, so I'll goof around. I thought I could breeze my way through things and try to be fun. It's so much easier than having to do stuff like understanding other people. But after meeting you and the others, I've changed a little. You have. You have. Not everything about everyone's cool, right? Everybody has parts of them that are cool or lame. But they're all doing what's best for themselves. After seeing you all like that, I think I got scared. There's no way you can understand each other unless you say what you think. Staying quiet and trying to act cool won't tell anybody anything. Seeing someone way smaller than me put everything they have into something made me ashamed of myself. I never tried my hardest in anything. I don't take anything seriously. That's why I never gain anything and why I'm, I'm never happy. I realize that I'm not living my life at all. All the dots. Junpei. Haha, <laughs> what's with that face? I can be serious sometimes too, right? Junpei laughs. When I got back those pictures of you, I, it crossed my mind. In the end, I just wanted you to trust in me. Oh, I do now. I do. Like, 
If someone like you could trust me, then I might be worth something. But trying to get you to rely on me to solve this is just wrong. You're an important friend of mine, after all. Junpei laughs, embarrassed. You sense that Junpei trusts you. One to go! Hopefully we can finish that one off, because I want to see that one end. Because I'm really start starting to like Junpei because of his social rank. Level 9, Magician. It sucks that this place doesn't have any swings. Don't you sometimes just get the urge to swing once in a while? Didn't I bring that up at some point, that there's no swings? I used to ride swings a lot when I was a kid. I had to get close to the sky and think that I could go somewhere else. Somewhere that isn't here. All the dots. That's why I think about when I was on a swing. Let's ride on one together sometime. You know how to get two people on one swing, right? One stands and the other sits. You and Chupe spend some time talking about all kinds of things. Evening. Arf, arf. Dum, dum. It's Ken's social link. Right, so. I want to make sure I got a persona of his social link. And I can't remember what it is, so we'll speak to I guess. I have to admit. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I want to make sure Ken's goes up. So, social link Ken. Why can't I not remember what Ken's is, though? Judge. Only rank one. That seems odd. Still need to get up um, Akihiko's. We've got four chances. Don't think that's happening. Well, we've not got four chances. We need to get it up by four. So we need four chances. Babies, whatever. Ryoji. That's gone. That's gone. I missed my chance when I went for Akihiko. Right, so um, Ken is Justice. We've got two more with Ken. Still need the Student Council. There's, there's a few that it's like... I'm so close. A Aeon, I, I hope I can get up completely. So anyway, I need a Justice Persona. So, let me go. Town map. Doom. Doom, doom. Doom, doom. Doom, doom, doom. All right, so. Let's see here. Want to take a quest? That's not what I wanted. Why am I going there? It's not the right one. I don't have an Aeon Arcana at all, do I? Don't think I do. It'd be at the top, wouldn't it? No, it's not alphabetical. Because that would be sensible. That would be sensible. Alright, so I want to justice, don't I? Angel will do. Nope, I want to say yes. There we go. Right, so let's go all the way back and see Ken. Time up. The dorm! Go on, go inside. There we go. Doom. Doom, doom. What's the matter, Yuki-san? Angel! Spend the new Ken? Yes. Okay, well, let's go. Ken seems happy. Go to an ice strip ball with Katsu Restaurant. Munch munch, this is delicious, Yuki-san. You and Ken chatted over your meal. The bond between you and Ken is growing. It's starting to get late. You decide to head back to the dorm. The 15th. Friday. Hello? Is there someone in Tartarus? Someone stuck? Your cell phone rang. Good morning, this is Elizabeth. I'm calling to inform you that another human has strayed into Tartarus. Two this time, I believe. Please don't delay in carrying out your rescue. Goodbye now. Very well, the call ended. Lunch time. It's finally time for lunch. Hello, Yuki-san. Right, that's what we're doing. Are you available after school? For now. I see. Would you like to would you like to be interested? Yeah, I would like to be interested. Would you be interested in walking home together? I want to be beside you. Seems that I guess would like to spend time with you after school. Maybe you should spend some time with her. Oh, it's you, Yuki. Well, all the dots. Do you have time today? I do. 
Uh, I see. I uh, have something to tell you. Come see me after school if you're free. Well, I have time, but not for you, I'm sorry. I'll see you later. Akihiko is acting strange. Maybe you should ask him about this later. Maybe I should, but I won't. So I'm busy. The lunch break is almost over. You decide to return to your classroom. Afternoon. Doom, doom, doom. Sob. Finally, on September 24th, the Satsuma Rebellion ended. This marked the end, sniff, the end of the age of the samurai. We're going to skip the next chapter and go back to the Sengoku era. There's so much more to cover. Huh? Modern history? You guys are still juniors. You'll have plenty of time to learn modern history when you're seniors. People talk about the end of the world, but don't worry. It'll still be another school year. Eh, it depends what we do. Come on, haven't you paid attention? Look how long this country has survived so far. You feel tired. Close your eyes, yes. Your consciousness drifts away as you close your eyes. You start to feel better. Your condition is now got right. After school. I guess, where are you? Class is end of it today. Um, Yuki-san. I want to be by your side. Agus is looking directly into your eyes. Would you like to spend time after school with Agus? Yep. Thank you very much. Shall we go? Agus seems happy. The mall! Excuse me, could I trouble you for a moment? Have you seen a kitty cat around here? She's a precious little white spotted cat named Mooly. She slipped away when I wasn't looking. I'm so worried about where she could have gone. She almost as old as I am, so I doubt she could have gotten very far. A white spotted cat? Did you see one, Yuki-san? I might have. My stars, really, whereabouts might this have been? Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, don't remember what station. Thank you, dear. Thank you. I'll go look for her. I have no idea if I'm right. The old lady left to look for her cat. A white spotted cat named Mooly. You don't mind, Yuki-san. Could we help her look? Seems the old lady will suffer greatly if we, if they remain separated for much longer. Sure. Yes, let's do our best. Hmm. What's the phrase usually used in situations like these? What goes around comes around. He hits you in the back of the head. That's it! I've discovered a new recipe! I guess seems happy. She could be so hungry by now that her stomach and spine are only a minute away. Hmm, that one works. Or is that an instant away? Anyway, we should hurry. Hello, Mooney-san. Mooney-san, are you there? There's no trace of her. I can sense hostile reactions such as shadows, but this... I'm useless, aren't I? No, no, you're trying, that's what's important. I'm sorry, I was the one who began the search. All the dots. It's not working out after all. How could a machine like myself have feelings like a normal person? All the dots. It's getting dark, we should return to the dorm for today. Thank you very much, Yuki-san. Makes me happy that you took the time to indulge me in this. I guess he's smiling. I feel that you understand I guess better now. Yay! Rank 4. Level 4, Aeon! I'll be going back alone today. I need some time to think. I'm sorry, and after you invited me out too. That's fine, don't worry about it. You decide to go back to the dorm separately. Alright. Evening. Hello! Um, let's go to Tartarus tonight. No, no. It's been a while since I suggested we should go. Ever since I was at the lab, I've been so confused. But I'm not confused anymore. I want to fight. With you. Well, alright then. No social link for Ken. Let's see what Igus has to say. The media is trying to swing public opinion by reporting on Stranger's activities in a positive light. And the most popular searches on the internet are Nick's cult and the end of the world. So it's the popular searches. So it is affecting 
the world. Because if it was like Google, because it would be Google, wouldn't it? I assume it would be Google anyway. So yeah, if that's coming up, Nick's cult end of the world, it's spread across the world. So humanity is now going to be thinking what Strager is thinking. And it's going to be sort of drawing forth Nyx. So that's why Nyx is coming. So we need to stop that. Turn off the internet. Problem solved. There you go. Isn't that strange? Why are people looking forward to the fall? Um, because it's interesting. And if it's interesting, I think people are going too far. There's a number of people who have already given up the will to live. Indeed, it is dangerous, it is dangerous. Alright, so let's go back to our room then. Go to bed early. Yep! 